Um, Australia has been uh, very leading uh, in this area in uh, light metals and uh, advanced composite materials. Uh, this has been uh, for many, many years, maybe 25 years or so. And we have been in, in composite materials, we have been concentrating on uh, carbon fiber uh, reinforced polymer matrix. We have also done uh, metal matrix composites reinforced by uh, ceramic particles or ceramic uh, uh, wires. And uh, we have been looking at the mechanical properties and their reliance uh, on the uh, uh, loading conditions, for instance, the weather conditions and mechanical loading or external impact and so on and so forth on the uh, durability of the composite material and on the impact capacity of the composite material. So we have been doing this kind of research for uh, so many years and then we have got uh, a significant achievement uh, compared with the uh, counterparts in all over the world in this area, we are very leading in this area. We can uh, offer a lot because uh, what Indian uh, car industry and aerospace industry do, uh, they have used some quite uh, uh, light uh, materials like composites, but basically they are actually the contractor from the uh, overseas uh, like a Boeing or Airbus and those uh, uh, companies. There are several ways. Uh, one is that they can uh, let us know what's the difficulties they have encountered in their production line and then uh, what they want to improve in that way so that our Australian uh, partners and, and researchers can uh, focus on those problems and then to help them to solve those problems. And the other way around is that uh, they can develop collaborative research project with us. So Australian government is very generous in a way that we are uh, like ARC, Australian Research Council's uh, linkage project we allow to have uh, overseas industry to participate in our program. And then through that way, we can have a long-term uh, research project with them to solve from the uh, uh, very fundamental to their production problems.